Hi Libra, welcome to your reading for the month of July. Let's see Libra, what is important for you to know in this month? What, who is coming towards you? Um, yeah, we will just go with the cards here and see what um, they want you to know at this time. Okay, so Libra, please consider to subscribe if you haven't done it yet. Join me here for future readings. Um, give a like to this video also helps me a lot and I appreciate that um, so keep in mind this is a general reading so it may not resonate with you um, you know every single message here but uh, please um, keep that in mind all right take only what uh, makes sense for you but also you should know that sometimes um the cards are giving messages that may not resonate with you right now but later you will um you know start to understand everything that um uh, i will say now to you all right so um you are trying to you are trying to grow something here in july you are very grounded very focused on changing something in your life creating something new um something that it will last something that will um is like to find your purpose is something that you wanna um do in your life you know maybe something that you've been thinking of um a long time ago you knew that this this situation will improve your life uh, in a um, very much you know so um, you know better what is it that you may have been delayed late, lately but in july you will um, do your best you know you will do everything that is in your power to grow this um project this idea whatever it is that you are looking forward to to grow in your life okay um let's see what the tarot has for you libra let's see what else for you who or what is coming towards you so we see that the main energy in july it's you focusing on creating something new in your life, on giving, um, you know, more of your time and energy to a project, to an idea that you have it a long time ago. And you know that if you do this, you will, you would be better. Your life would be easier. But let's see who or what is coming towards you in this month. All right. You know, whoever, what, whatever will happen, you need to know one thing, that you don't care. <laughs> that you don't care. You are like... You know what you know, you know, you know what you have, you know what you are capable of. And um, I still uh, feel here with all your cards the same thing, that you will be so resilient. You will break free from a situation here. You will take um, your life in your own hands. And... Um, you will focus here on creating something look at this you have the magician it's like you you create your own world here and nobody can have nothing to say about this it's like you ignoring everyone else look at this you are just you with your thoughts with your ideas and you will be very focused on mm, getting things done the way you want you know um some of you here you are looking forward to um maybe you know have more 
financial stability, make more money, you know, and you you will be focused on this, on maybe disconnecting from someone or something, you know, doing some things on your own for yourself, uh, being more independent, you know. Now, let's see what else is um, challenging you in this month. But it's actually until now, you know, you will be very, um, very calm. And it's like you are so focused on your goals that nothing can move you out of that. But let's see what else. Who, what is coming towards you. Wow, you have the strength card. Well, again, there might be a situation where you need to have patience. Eight of Pentacles. This is something that requires for you a lot of effort, focus, patience, and, you know, strength. Because um, it's something that, yes, takes time. And it won't be easy for you with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse here. You may have moments in July when you may feel like... Um, or I get like someone might tell you, stop doing that, it's for nothing or something like that, you know. But I feel like you know, you know what, you know what you want, you know. You know your purpose here and nothing can distract you from this because you know that your work isn't for nothing, you know. And it's like, it's enough if you believe in yourself, you don't need nobody to believe in you to support you you know in this way it's all right if they they don't see um where you are going with all the situation if you know is it's all that you need and um so some of you here you will need to improve some skills to learn something new to research to spend some time on this become better of something so a lot of patience when it comes to accumulate all this new information so that's why there are some delays here things may not go as fast as you thought they will because there is this need of working hard on something okay now uh let's see libra what else i have a lot of cards here for you um okay Let's see what other messages. Let's take this one. This is an oracle deck. Let's see, Libra. First card. In July, you must forgive if you want to be free. Do it for yourself. So, one of the first advices here for you is to forgive someone or forgive yourself stop you know uh, keeping all these um, negative feelings because um, it's useless and it will be so great for you to um, you know go through this relief so forgive and move on your next card is remember that you cannot change anyone but yourself so you may try to make someone understand something in july as i've seen here in your reading um, it will be a moment when you will just not care anymore because you know you will realize that it's just um you know um what to say it's it's just um not worthy of your time of your energy you will understand that you cannot change people um, if they don't want to see something, then nobody can force them, right? And you will understand this. Stay present. That's where life happens. So, yes, very focused here, Libra, in your present moment. In July, you will be focused on everything that you can control. You won't think of about what happened or what may have come you will be 
present in the present moment here. You want to find your path, to find a way um, to grow something here in your life. And um, yeah, for some of you, July is the start. I get another message here for you, Libra, like, in July, you will have enough of others telling you what to do. You will just have enough of this, you know, and you will just take charge here. You will not um, keep for yourself some things. You will express how you feel and you will put yourself in that position where you will say to others um, what they should do, how they should do things. Okay, let's see. From this oracle, you have shedding the world. There is a change coming your way. Cultivate a sense of adventure so you will be able to see these new prospects. So definitely there is a change coming your way. As I said, in, um, in July, Libra, it is... Um, it is a new beginning here, a new phase starting. You will be very focused on a new thing here in your life and nothing can take you out of track. You will be very focused on that. Let's see your last advice here, Libra. Anything else that you need to hear? When it comes to next month, tell the truth. Communicate with integrity. You may need to level with someone. This person could even be you. Are you saying you are fine when you don't mean it? Are you swallowing your needs because you don't want to rock the boat? When we hide the truth, it eventually comes out in destructive ways. Act with integrity and say what's on your mind. While honesty may lead to short-term discomfort, your long-term peace and happiness are worth it. So, Libra, this is what I've got for you. This is your reading. I really hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to subscribe, to like this video, to share it with everyone that you know. Um, I wish you to have a great month of July and um, all the best.